Long time ago, in a kingdom nearby, the kind-hearted Lord William and the elegant Lady Catherine wanted to get away from all the royal obligations for the weekend to Balmoral Castle. Once their children were safely back at school, the couple felt like they could finally have some fun. There were even rumors that the meeting with King Charles and Queen Camilla was not only a holiday. Some people believed that it was a secret session. However, as soon as the sun went down over the castle, another hidden kind of magic sprang to life. Being as always carefree, William came across a small wardrobe that contained enchanted clothes. It was easy because he put on an incredible dress with shimmering that seemed like actual gemstones. The fabric was alive, and within little time, he is completely transformed into Lady Willow, the grand day theatrical diva. Catherine, intrigued by the playful atmosphere, decided to join in the fun. She donned a striking suit, complete with a top hat and a monocle, transforming into Lord Catherine, the witty and dashing counterpart to Lady Willow. That evening went happily hosting a ball for the castle staff, including all their workers and bidding the spirit of that night. Participants were allowed to dress up, and this ensured that they represented a colorful collage of personalities. The castle rang with music and youths' laughter. Everyone felt like who they wanted to be. During the celebrations, people listened to the stories of the king and the queen. Lady Willow tried to express some stunning thoughts on the impossibility of getting the dress. Lord Catherine said that when she was a child, she wanted to go on a trip. Both of them described how women freed themselves from the mundane and uninteresting life and how much they liked it. And as the evening was approaching the slightest twinkle of the next morning, the beautiful night emerged. He gave her a cup of coffee, and they lapsed back into royal form, but the evening was etched in their minds. They learned that one can turn formal royal duties into joyous activities which symbolize the tastefulness of life and the pleasure of personality. Ever since then, they started having a masquerade ball at Balmoral every year, and inviting the kingdom to join them, and reminding everyone that it's okay to be silly, to be creative, and to be yourself. And as a result, the royal family was the management, or has been able to maintain being responsibly fun and not too serious, which is what being together is all about. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe.